Buzzy meets Maxwell the cat. All right, children. Recently, I have seen how you act in recess. Yeah, what about it? How you're so rude to each other. Do you really think calling each other bro is appropriate? What if your family has a different religion than the classmates? You're denying his existence and math addictions. Actually, Molly, it's just a way to call a friend. And either way, we are all twins. No. To fix your protocol issues, we're going to start talking correctly. The fun is, you have to guess how. Say hello to Maxwell the Cat. Do, 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 do. To talk, I'll pick a random student to participate. I'm sure all of you will succeed and live better. You go first. Mm. Hello, Maxwell the Cat. Wrong! You are informal enough. You have to say greetings. <laughs> now we go. Greetings, Maxwell. Don't look at the cat, it's Indian! Hello, formerly Maxwell the cat. Playtime. Your efforts on this task are miserable because it has no mass. Your speech level is goofy and your capitalization is wrong. Kindly accept your fate and run on my ruler. Greetings, Maxwell. It is such a pleasant time to meet you. My name is Nick. Give me that ruler, I'm gonna meet them kids ass! Students, why aren't you doing it right, bird? Uh, fine. I'll do it myself. Thanks for making me ruin the fun. If you're being offensive. Oh. Mr. Baltimore, you are one of the best examples of selfishness and respectfulness I have ever seen in my family life. I have seen respectful people, but they aren't even close to you. To your bad behavior, I respond mutually. I hope your parents hate you. Fork. The end. Moral of the story. Disrespect your teachers.